Hello and welcome, 23rd of January. It's about 11 o'clock in the morning. It's an utterly dull and miserable day today. Let's have an update. So first up, an onion update. I sowed some onion sets uh, middle of November, about two months ago. Red electric onions and Senshu yellow. So there's six rows here. One, two, three, four, five, six. First row was the red electric onions. Not one's come up. Senshu yellow, yes. Red electric, no. Sensu yellow, yes. Red, no. Sensu yellow, yes. So, Sensu yellow are the first ones up. I'm sure the red are all right as well. But they're the first up. Most notable here on this end, where that half was Sensu yellow. This half was the red electric. So, we'll go a bit further down the plot. I mean, uh, Fixing. Look at that. It's almost a straight line now. Almost a straight line now. More onion news. I did leave two onions in the ground. That one. It's starting to go wrong. Now. This one was starting to produce. It was sort of bolting, but it didn't produce any flower heads or anything. I've been keeping my eye on this, and it looks to me like there's almost five or six new onions sprouting in there in, in like a clump. Interesting, let's keep our eye on that. Right, down to the bottom of the plot where I've been clearing out an area for a building project. And there was a tree there. There was a tree there. I have removed it. Um, let's, let's have an update on that. So we started digging, we've got a pile of soil and we hit a barrier, <laughs> a barrier being some old carpet that's been there since before I took it over. Oh, put carpet down. Don't put carpet down. It might prevent weeds initially, then it just sits there, grass grows on top, it just stays there. And it's just, I'm going to have to take that up. Oh, How far does that go? Right. I'll dig. I'm gonna pull it all up, see how far it goes. Then we'll get to the tree. See grass was just growing on top of it. Pointless. Pointless. Right. Get rid of that. Continue digging the tree up. I've had this plot nearly 10 years now. I'm still digging up things that the previous occupier has buried. Don't put carpet down. Don't put carpet down. So. The way the world is at the minute, we're supposed to be planting more trees, aren't we? I felt bad taking that one up. I think it was a hawthorn or a blackthorn. Anyway, so I decided to reuse as much as that tree 
as possible. So three of the branches were long and strong. So I'm going to reuse those as canes. And at the back here, I've put the remnants of the tree in the pile of wood to be helpful to insects. This is, this is, I did some uh, trimming of the holly tree while I was at it. Let's pile that up at the back, got open fields uh, behind the allotment plot. That and brambles, <laughs> nature's own barbed wire. We don't get many intruders at all here, but um, a bit more of a hindrance for them. You don't want to be coming through there, do you? Right, strawberries. Let's have a before and after. So the strawberries are looking all right, aren't they? Um, these are the runners I took just last year, so they're the newest ones. The ones in the pots in the middle, that's how much grass in I had to take them out and, and repot them. So they're gonna go back in another part of the plot once I clear a suitable space once the weather picks up ever so slightly into the shed slash greenhouse overwintering peppers and chilies that one looks all right that one looks all right the others are a bit a bit too brown for my liking but you never know that one there is okay too I've moved them towards this end of the Shed slash green so they get a bit more light. My garlic. I'll be ready to go out into the plot soon. Right. I think that is it for this week. Thank you for watching. Click subscribe. Send me a comment. And I'll see you next time. Cheers.